Guys, today's Lost Sector's Chamber Starlight in the Dreaming City. I'm going to give you guys a quick run through on how I like to do this Lost Sector in just over two minutes. So I'm going to start off by just killing this Unstoppable with Leviathan's Breath and Squarm Maid. That's just enough. So I like to run through this room just as fast as possible. It's kind of dangerous, but I think it saves more time than it loses if you die. Because you, you really don't ever die running through there because of the current mods. I throw that storm nade to get the unstoppable's attention because if you don't, he'll run around that rock and you won't be able to see him. But our goal is to just post up here and kill all the champions from this one spot. So if you don't get this unstoppable's attention, he'll also try to run away and hide behind that rock. So I had my hand cannon ready to stun him. I would also like to kill the boss from this corner, but I was never get her to ag I never got her to aggro on me, so she ran away. So I'm just kind of playing hide and seek with her right now. I think she's over there at the at the circle around where the where the chest is. So I'm gonna head over there. Right up there she is. So I'm just gonna kill her before I kill the overload. You still get platinum and you still get exotics that way and it's easier just to get rid of the boss if you can. So my game plan for this overload is to get my grenade back and throw a grenade and then thunder crash it. I could have done it right there but I almost died so I just hit behind a, hit behind a rock. I got a bolt shot prepared in my fusion in case I needed it but I don't. And I killed that, and I'm going to get the chest. Alright, I'm going to do a real quick little build overview for you guys. Uh, I'm going to be using Striker Titan with Thruster, so I can kind of have the Hunter feeling of using my dodge and getting some cooldowns back. And I will also collect the orbs that I make for me. Uh, Catapult Lift because I like it, and Thunderclap just because I'm using, uh, I'm using Heart of Most Light. It's easier to proc than shoulder charge. Uh, storm grenades, because I prefer them. Touch of thunder, because it makes my storm grenades channels, amazing. And knockout, because it'll heal me when I get an empowered melee kill. Spark of feedback. They melee me, I'll hit them back harder. I like the 10 resilience. Overall, it's a very good um, fragment. Spark of shock makes my grenades stun overloads. Spark of magnitude makes my storm grenade last longer. And Spark of Resistance makes me take less damage while I'm surrounded. My playstyle, I'm surrounded all the time. If you're not surrounded all the time and you're playing a bit slower, then I would take Spark of Ions. I'm using Fatebringer because it stuns on stops. Um, just any fusion rifle works. This is mainly just like a, a workhorse weapon. I used it for... I thought about using it for the overload, but I never actually did. So you don't really need an overload stun as long as you can stun it with a grenade or any like all arc ability or anything else listed here. Leviathan's Breath for most of the Unstoppables and the boss, just because it does a lot of damage. Really, um, the perks that you really need here are Thunderous Retort, really good, and Amped Up, which makes you more resistant while amplified, and you're always amplified on Arc this season. Moving on to the mods, I use a Hands-On and an Ashes to Assets to get my Super back faster. Firepower and Heavy Handed to make me orbs, collected by a powerful attraction. A grenade kickstart helps me get my grenade back faster with uh, also on top of that with lightning strikes twice get my grenades back fairly quick um, on the chest plate just two two resistance mods and an emergency reinforcement because I'm making so many orbs with these mods and I'm collecting them super easy with powerful attraction on my boots I have a grenade recharge, a healing mod, and an all abilities recharge just to get my abilities back faster. And on my mark I have distribution and bomber Try to try to live in that fantasy of thruster get my abilities back that those hunters have with assassin's cow and their dodge. Overall that's the whole build, good luck farming today.